We're here behind the Notre Dame bench at Notre Dame Stadium. Blue goal game. Kavari Russell joining me and out there for the first drive, working hard. Give me a summation of uh, what this team's accomplished in the spring. Uh, so far, we accomplished a lot. I mean, just like I say, we still installed a new defense. So I think so far it's not looking like we're doing too well on the, on the defensive side. But I think it's just a swirl of the game. Everybody's trying to really grasp what's going on, what we learned so far in the spring, and offensively, just trying to get, uh, work with Everett and uh, Malik back because the offense is totally different with Malik and Everett back than when we had Tommy Reese. So like, I think our playbooks are not limited no more because we, we got running quarterbacks. So I think that's what we're just trying to really out here experiment with all, all the new things we, that we came to, that, that we came to in the spring. For the team, I mean, they don't have to have a public spring game. They could have just another scrimmage in Loftus or, or, or over on the practice fields. How much of an advantage is it for you guys to be able to get out here in front of 30,000 or so people and play in a game like atmosphere? And I, th I think that's what it is. Like I said, the, the fact that we can get 30,000, like not every team uh, in the country can get 30,000 people to come and watch our scrimmage in a sense. So I think that's a big thing just for, for the younger guys, not necessarily for our upper class, but for the younger guys to get a game feel to see how they prepare under pressure. Like I said, our new, it's all in a new defense. Like, can you really grasp what, what coach has been trying to teach and like with this game like feel, like this like swirl of game? It's going to get to you if you let it. But like I said, I think that's the biggest thing. The fact you can't get a game atmosphere why, why not do it you didn't play that many snaps today <laughs> because you're playing so well and every coach when I say you know who's impressing you who's ahead of everybody else everybody's saying Kavari's ahead of everybody else that means you're the leader of this secondary and that's a responsibility I mean it is a responsibility but I I, I think everybody in the country would kind of suspect that but uh, I mean being the five playing starting 26 games and being the oldest one the second day oldest one the defense to be honest uh, so I, I, I I'd expect that I think everybody everybody else in our um, defense would expect that too so I mean, I'm out here like just, I'm out here coaching still. I'm, I'm, I feel like I'm a young Kobe Bryant right now. When Kobe came out, he always coached. So I'm not comparing myself that I'm as good as Kobe. I'm just saying. But I'm out here coaching the young guys and trying to help them out and help them progress as, uh, as the game goes on. Hey, a lot of work in front of you and your teammates as fall approaches. Um, you've got exams. You've got summer school. People know it's a a year-round event, uh, conditioning, and then fall practice. What do you have to accomplish between now and that first game? Me personally or as a team? Are you saying me personally? As a, as a team, both of, both you personally and a team. I think for the defense, we got to just limit, uh, eliminate the mental mistakes that we keep uh, doing at, as spring went on. It kept going down, but I think we I mean, probably averaged 20 or so mental mistakes each and every day. Just got me some new defense, I think. So I think that's the uh, biggest thing for our defense is try to in, 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 increase our knowledge of the game, like re increase our football IQ and off offensively just allow them to click each and every time. I think that's the biggest thing, just like clicking every, every single play. Every, I mean, he's playing with young, uh, young receivers that he's never played with two years ago. So just uh, getting the timing down offensively and just allowing them to click each and every play. And us, just like I said, reducing the mental mistakes, uh, like try to grasp the game and increase our uh, mental capacity. All right, a great day for Kavari Russell, and he's not going to be all that sore tomorrow. That won't be the case in the fall. With Kavari Russell on the sidelines of Notre Dame Stadium, I'm Jack Nolan, Fighting Irish Digital Media.